This is Lorelai Wazchuk. She is nursing really well, which is a relief. The nurse just came in a little bit ago, so she's going to get Lorelai ready for a bath soon. And in the meantime, we're just enjoying some cuddly time. This is our postpartum room. We got here about 1045. She has a bassinet that is on wheels, so we can easily move her around the room and to the nursery. We have tons of storage in here, which has been really helpful for both Ryan and I's things. We have tons of seating. We have two chairs and a couch, which has been great because both our parents have been here at the same time. And I have a table where I can eat my meals that is also on wheels. So it is 6.50 the first night. I got a new robe and i got to take off my makeup and wash my face and little laurel and i got her first bath she's just been sleeping i'm gonna try and nurse her again in like 10 minutes ryan left to get dinner and shower and go put the kids to bed okay. oh my goodness does it feel good? Mm. Ryan just got back from putting the girls to bed. We're trying to keep their nighttime routine and daily routine as normal as possible. Ryan went by the house and he took a shower and he got to brush his teeth and get anything he needs for tonight. It has been a great first day in the hospital. Everything went really well. But we know we have a long night ahead of us, so I will check in with you in the morning. It is 6 a.m. on January 31st. We haven't really vlogged much this past night. Just because I think we're just kind of taking our time with everything. But I got blood taken to see how much blood I lost during surgery. Ryan's alarm is going off. And Lorelai has gone to the nursery twice as her second time. So she's there so Ryan and I can get some rest. But then his alarm goes off. We got, I want to say like... Five and a half hours of sleep, not bad. I definitely have more energy than I did when I was like falling asleep, but yeah, I'll check in more today, hopefully. That's the plan. It is 7.15 and I finally went to the bathroom. Ryan is over here holding our tiniest and there goes the phone. Mama pee. That's me in every video. Every time we have a kid, we gotta talk about your pee. I just did. You said bathroom, not pee. I went to the bathroom. Have you okay. pooped yet? No. Okay. Baby pooped. Ryan has his Red Bulls over there. It's a good camera. They can see it. You can tell he got sleep. He's sassy again. I'm not angry. Four hours. Hey, four hours is better than zero hours, yes. Yeah. Okay, so. And she's just resting. We're still waiting for my milk to come in, so that's kind of frustrating. But we're doing well, and I just ordered breakfast. Ryan's gonna get breakfast from someplace. But now we're just relaxing and 
think that's it. I don't think we really have any other updates right now. Right, handsome? Still in the middle there. Oh yeah, we still haven't figured that one out. But we will figure out a middle name today. So we'll be back with some more updates. I just took my first shower. It's five o'clock on January 31st. Um, we are just, she's over here, relaxing. It is 7.10 at night. Little Miss is just relaxing. I just blow dry my hair like I would normally do at home so it's pretty straight so it feels nice and warm and good and then she's just just she's just perfect I know I know I know so we just needed a just here so she like last time she had a good feeding it was like 3 a.m like where she was latching for 10 to 17 minutes aside and then she wasn't eating like she was getting so frustrated because nothing was coming out so i called lactation and one lady came and she was just like it's fine like she's pooping and peeing a lot like it's not i'm not concerned she's only supposed to have four you know feedings in the first 24 hours and she's still within that limit and you know which yeah that makes sense but then it got to be like 12 o'clock noon and I just started to feel like I needed to do something for her so another lactation consultant came in named Debbie who, who we had before with Olivia and she got us a little syringe so we could entice her that was her word with some formula so she thinks it's coming out of the breast so she would latch and she did a really great job with that she latched for 20 minutes on one side and then like 17 on the other so it, it really worked for her and then around 5 20 we did another feeding that one was around three and then we did another feeding like that on my own well with ryan's help actually um because it takes like a lot of you need more than two hands to do it to hold the baby the right way and then someone using the syringe and at the right time and stuff so um we did that and she ate and it really worked for her so um that just makes me feel better. And then she's so tiny that her newborn diapers fall off. So they're like low rise diapers. That's so funny. So um, I'm about to hop on this call with little Olivia. Say goodnight so she can see her sister again. So I'll check back in a little bit. It is 7-12. It is our last day in the hospital. My OB has let us decide if we wanted to go home today, and we do because we miss Olivia and Zara, and we're ready to get our whole family together. She hungry? She's just on her passy. No try feeding her again. Yeah, I can. It is February 1st, and it is 7.24 in the morning. We actually all got a good night's sleep. Lorelai went into the nursery, I think around 10.30. She nursed on one side for 20 minutes and the other side for 40 minutes. And then after that, I had them swaddle her up, take her with them to the nursery, she came back around 2.30 because they said she was a little fussy and probably needed to eat again. Her weight dropped um, 
to six pounds, 14 ounces. And that's 8% it dropped. So um, it was getting close to 10%. So we're going to see um, when they weigh her today how that goes. breakfast. I ordered some french toast. I feel like I haven't really vlogged much. Um, so I want to do a lot more today of just vlogging and getting pictures of her in different like just like natural pictures but like pictures because I, I don't want to you know this is like when you look back on it it's like a brief moment like the hours seem really long you're up all night but it is so small and so i just want to make sure i'm enjoying every little moment <laughs> Colors like the moon. 